Nikki Sex, I'm hoping that a joke will land up. I have a request, Ujjasri, to come and tell us about sick lads. Right, Ujjasri, come here. Thank you so much, Rotary Chandigarh Shivalik, for having us here. Uh, so, uh, we are having this beautiful uh, film festival called Sikh Lens, Sikh Arts and Film Festival in India at Tagore Theatre in Chandigarh on 21st of February. And it's going to be a full day film festival, so we are going to start at 11am. And at 8am, we are going to show 17 beautiful Sikh centric films. Uh, and 5 films are going to be Indian productions and 12 films are going to be international productions from US, from Scotland, from Australia, England and Canada, you know, major parts of the world. And these are all uh, films made by uh, filmmaking students or filmmaking professionals, you know, across the world and they are all handpicked by Sick Lens. Sick Lens is a film festival that happens every year in California in the third week of November. This year it happened from 19th to 22nd or 22nd to 24th of 22nd to 24th. So normally it happens in the third week of November every year. And then uh, films once handpicked, they travel across the world in various chapters of Sick Lens. And we are very happy to you know host Sick Lens for the very first time in India and that too in Chandigarh. So please Susi Sare Ao, uh, you know, entry is totally free. You are most welcome, uh, families are welcome, you know, kids are welcome, everybody is welcome. And uh, it's, you know, people's festival, you know, there is no celebrity, you know, the audience are our stars right here. And please mark our presence, you know, exhibition, we are going to host exhibition by you know, Guinea's World Book Record Artist, Limca World Book Record Artist, India, World, India, India Book of Record Artist. They are all be present and we have fabulous performances also lined up during the day. Uh, schedule. Uh, so we are going to have performances and we are going to have a we and we will be sharing personal invites to each one of you right here today. Thank you so much and I look forward to have you all at Sicklens. This year, please. Most welcome. Would you like to say something? Uh, over to BK Singh, sir. Please, Ali, sir. Ali, sir. Please. 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 Here he comes. Ashok! Yeah, yeah. Thank you, sir. I'll talk to you. Good evening. Uh, my name is Bikki Singh and I'm the founder of uh, Siglans Foundation. So we started this initiative almost 25 years back. The fundamental goal is to create scholarships into the leading film schools. Because, you know, Sikhs have no proper representation in films, media, broadcast journalism, and uh, they don't themselves go into to make a decision or properly uh, Sikhs are represented in this field. So to fix that problem, we started this program. We have produced uh, uh, quite a few films and you will get to see for the first time uh, 17 films uh, in uh, Chandigarh. And uh, there are a lot of other programming we do, training the youth uh, on filmmaking. So that's another collaboration uh, we are looking at, working with the schools, how we can train uh, next generation youth in artificial intelligence, augmented reality, virtual reality. So, you know, those are the fields which are coming and uh, and we do all those as uh, free training, you know. Thank you. What type of films are there? Are they commercial, documentaries, or religious? Uh, good question. Uh, these are documentaries, short films. Short. Uh, yeah. You know, the average length of these films is 20 minutes. Okay. And uh, some are like 14 minutes, some are 22 minutes. So these are like inspirational stories about uh, Sikhs. And they are mostly in English. With uh, If they are like in Punjabi or Hindi, uh, 
their subtitles. The whole purpose is, you know, see, we are trying to solve a problem because, you know, our turban and beard equates to terrorism back down there. And um, people have uh, just no idea. You know, post 9-11, things, they became really uh, bad. So how do we fix that problem? So we were like all stuck within the Gurdwaras. Or what you can say that we are trying to take the Sikh messaging outside the four walls of the Gudwara in Main Street, you know. And yeah, to educate people, you know, who we are, you know. So that's the program, you know. And Lucy problem is that films so how do I fix that problem? So there is a lot of education to be done uh, with parents also to encourage them to let. Uh, children uh, go into films, you know. There are uh, huge opportunities, but you know, then the third thing is if you're not on the table, uh, you're not decision maker. Just Netflix acquisition, content acquisition budget for this year is like close to um, uh, uh, 20, no, no, 22 uh, billion. Uh, dollars, 22 oh. billion. Last year it was 14 oh. billion oh. acquisition budget. And so people, they can come around and say, well, how come they are not making uh, Sikh-centric films or they are not greenlighting? Well, question for them, when they select the script, they don't really get into the nitty-gritty. They are mainly concerned whether this film we are putting $10 million will produce us $100 million or $50 million. To do that decision-making, you got to know the subject matter. If they are not familiar with Sikh-centric stories, so that's what where our education process, we think that through these mainstream universities will help because these are next generation, 10 to 15 years down the line, uh, these students who go through our program will be in key positions to make those decisions, you know. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.